Now, KCAU 9 Sports. Welcome back. As summer approaches and football fields continue to be closed, it's not just the players who are missing out on getting those extra workouts in. The coaches are also missing out on big scouting opportunities as they look for that diamond in the rough. Recruiting is a year-round job for college football staff, so while many are able to adjust and still talk to the kids, it doesn't really replace getting to see athletes in summer camps, which may or may not happen this year. Thankfully for this fall, most of the recruiting has already taken place, meaning we won't see much of an impact at all in college football this year, but it's next year's recruiting class that could suffer with coaches not being able to find those hidden gems in the 2021 class. We miss out on spring ball. The other part of the spring is a lot of recruiting and just, you know, junior recruiting. And so for those juniors, a lot of that is done through social media. And so I think there's maybe a little bit more of a focus on junior recruiting and, and preparing for the, for the fall. Um, the recruiting aspect that's going to be heard is as we get into the summer is summer camps and getting a chance to see, you know, high school players in the summer. And, and it's going to be hard for those guys that are going to be seniors this upcoming year. Uh, to get their name out there as well. To the professional ranks, football is mourning one of its greatest coaches in the sports history today as the NFL announced that Hall of Fame coach Don Shula, the NFL's all-time winningest coach, has passed away at the age of 90. He is survived by his wife and five children. Shula was a head coach in the NFL for 33 seasons, including 26 of those with the Miami Dolphins, where among his many accomplishments, he led the 1972 Finns to a perfect season, the only team in NFL history to accomplish that feat. Shula has the most career wins of any coach at 347, with only two other coaches who have ever hit the 300 mark. Some more NFL news coming out today. The league announcing that no teams will play outside of the U.S. this upcoming season. The NFL had previously agreed to play one game in Mexico City and four games in London for the 2020 campaign with the Arizona Cardinals, Atlanta Falcons, Jacksonville Jaguars, and those Miami Dolphins all set to have home games in those contests, but the league does hope to return to international games in 2021. The league also will be announcing its fall regular season schedule on Thursday night. That's your check on sports. Tim, I'll send it back to you. All right, Jake, thanks much.